My name is Ashley Rodriguez, and as a food blogger, author, and consultant, it feels like I'm working and living in my kitchen every single day, except for today. There you go. Oh, hi, good hi. to see you. Hi, how are you? Well, always fine out in the woods. Oh, this is great. Let's go see what we can find. If it's edible, then that sounds good to me. Uh, everything is edible at least once. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 I see one. Oh, yeah. Look at that. That is so beautiful. It's not rocket science, you know. You can learn what a chanterelle is and enjoy a chanterelle in, in a few hours. It's still the same joy as yeah. a little kid Easter Sunday finding the eggs. Oh, you know, yeah. it's, it's just this. That's what it feels like. It feels like such a little treasure hunt. It is, it is. Now I'm getting hungry. Let's see what we got. Oh, Let's wow. See. Not too bad, huh? Not too bad. That is definitely lunch. Living in the Pacific Northwest, summer is so central. We all live for that summer. And then comes fall and people get depressed, summer's over. <laughs> but I don't because the mushrooms are coming. Cooking outside by the fire is my favorite way to cook. We're removing the dependence on elaborate equipment and relying on the beauty and simplicity of the ingredients themselves. What a great day. Thank you so much. Just seeing how you cook in here is just very inspiring. Gotta up my game a little bit, eh? <laughs> In each episode, we will search the outdoors for unique ingredients and prepare them in the wild. This is Kitchen Unnecessary.